There have been some questions about the impact on taxpayers for the proposed Clover School District bond referendum projects. We wanted to share how you can look at your own tax bill and calculate that impact. The ones shared here are for residences in both Clover and Lake Wiley and represent a range of home values. Your bill is the best place to see the impact you could be making for the children of Clover School District. Some things to keep in mind as we do our work here. The millage rate used for the 2021 taxes was 19.4 mills and is based on current assessments. The calculations for the tax impact in this presentation are based on borrowing $160 million in a 20-year bond at a 2.5% interest rate. Project costs are still being determined. It is possible that not all projects would be approved in the bond and that would also affect the millage rate. This first example shows how to evaluate the 2021 York County property bill that you might have received in the mail. The first piece we need to look at is the appraised value for tax purposes. The taxable value, which is typically less than the market value of this home, is $497,950. This is assessed at 4% to yield an assessed value of $19,918. Taking a look at the Where Your Tax Dollars Go section, you will find school operations calculated at 230 mills for a tax on this bill of $4,581.14. This is offset by an Act 388 tax credit of the same amount. Also in this section of the bill, you will see debt service, which is currently calculated at a rate of 19.4 mills for a tax here of $386.41. If we were to use the projected tax levy of 45.65 mills, there would be a tax of $909.26. This is a difference of $522.85 annually or $43.57 a month. Let's do the math for another home in our district. Taking 4% of the appraised value for tax purposes of $104,075, we see an assessed value of $4,163. School operations calculated at 230 mills for this home's assessed value yields a tax of $957.49. This is offset by an Act 388 tax credit of the same amount. Notice that the homestead exemption still applies to the overall tax bill. Debt service, calculated at a rate of 19.4 mills, yields a tax here of $80.76. To see what the cost would be for debt service at the estimated new levy, we multiply the assessed value of just over $4,000 by 0 .04565 to see a tax of $190.04, a difference of $109.28 annually or $9.11 per month. Let's look at one last example together. If you don't have the paper tax bill handy, you can view your online receipt from last year by visiting the York County Tax Assessor's Office website you can still find the appraised and assessed values. Here we see an appraised value of $328,357 and an assessed value of $13,134. Again, it was assessed at 4%. School operations calculated at 230 mills for this home's assessed value yields a $3,020.82 tax which is again offset by an Act 388 tax credit of the same amount. Debt service calculated at a rate of 19.4 mills gives a tax of $254.80. Multiplying the assessed value by the .04565 for the new estimated levy, we see a tax of $599.57. This is a difference of $344.70 annually or $28.73 a month. There are three things that will affect the actual millage rate when the bonds are sold if passed. Interest rates, impact fees, and our continued growth. 
The projected tax levy of 45.65 mills was estimated with a 2.5% interest rate on a 20-year bond for $160 million. We cannot sell the bond when the interest rate is being estimated. Rather, we would be selling it after the bond was passed by both the board and our taxpayers. Currently, interest rates remain low, making this a prime time to borrow money with less interest to be paid. Also of note is that bonds are sold at public auction for the lowest interest rate. Currently, we can already apply $2.08 million from the impact fees that have been collected as of January 31st of this year. When the last draw for the bond happens in the 25-26 school year, the total amount of impact fees collected to date would reduce the amount borrowed and therefore reduce the impact on taxpayers for this bond. Finally, growth in our community means there will be more people to share in the debt service to reduce the individual taxpayers' share. As taxable assessments increase, the net tax levy decreases. Thank you for taking a moment to do some tax math with us. We have developed an online calculator so that you can enter your home's taxable value and see the increase in the tax levy with different bond costs.